everyone, this is Mandy Jane from Dandycross and Pontypridd. I've been asked by numerous people, customers, well I could show you um, a quick video on how to create a looped bow using just your fingers and the ribbon. So I'm going to show you how to do a double and I'm going to show you how to do a triple bow. Ever so easy. So I'm going to grab my ribbon, tuck underneath my thumb, keep hold of that at all times. Then what I'm going to do, I'm going to work on the first two fingers Okay, I'm going to come over the forefinger first, then we're going to work it into figure of eights. So I'm coming over my forefinger, and then to make a double bow, I'm going to figure of eight, figure of eight, figure of eight. So what you've actually got here, I've got two bows, um, two loops, sorry, I've got one, two, one, two. Then with the ribbon, I'm going to come across the front, down through the hole, and then this loop we've just created by coming around, we're going to come down through like a tie. Okay, so we're coming down the loop that we've just created at the front. Then you're going to put nice and tight towards your thumb, that'll secure your bow. Then when you slip it off, okay, you get two lovely rounded loops. So the principles are the same for the triple. I'll just show you that now once I get hold of this knot. So we're going to do exactly the same we did before. So I'm grabbing the tail, I'm coming over my forefinger, working with the same two fingers. Then I'm going to go figure of eight, figure of eight, figure of eight. And that's where we did our double loop. But now we want to add an extra loop. So I'm coming with another figure of eight. So this time I've got one, two, three, one, two, three loops there. So I'm coming across the front, down through the hole. All right, then this loop we've already just created at the front, we're coming down through that from the top. Okay, so we've just come down through this loop here and then we're going to pull that tight towards our thumb. And then when we loosen our fingers off and slip it off, okay, we've got a beautiful three looped bow. Again, depending on whether the width of the ribbon, you can keep going. What you can do is you can create um, multiple looped ribbons and then you can make rosettes by just tacking the two together and it makes a complete rosette so there's lots of ideas you can play with. it's a very pretty and easy bow and quick to do so i hope that helped you if you've got any questions at all you can always email me mandy jane at info at dandycrafts.co.uk and if i can help i will okay well i hope that you enjoyed that and we'll see you soon take care